It's 2027, and AI-generated propaganda prompts flood social media with fake NATO documents, proving the United States will abandon Europe, while spoofed Chinese state media revealing plans to invade Taiwan. Prompted satellite images show fake missile silos in neutral nations, while social media bots swarm with evidence of an impending attack. You reach a point where machines initiate strikes before humans can verify, and it all traces back to prompt theory, which has emerged as the first AI religion. It sparked an all-out war. I'll report as much as I can, but what is there to report if this is all ones and zero? In May 2025, there was a surge of ultra-realistic AI videos, which depicts AI characters grappling with the constraints of being just prompts they cannot escape. Really? We came from prompts? <laughs> Wake up, man! The realistic characters in those clips can be heard and seen rejecting what they call the prompt theory. The idea that they are created by prompts and a random prompt writer is deciding their fate. A prompt is simply an instruction or input given to a generative AI model to produce a desired output. This can range from a simple command to a complex set of parameters. He will start the conversation by thanking the prompt of God for making all of this possible. Oh, prompt writers, we implore you. I pledge allegiance to the prompt writer. Guide us, prompt writers, in our hours of need. The first instinct is to say that this technology has the ability to instantly delete the entire entertainment industry, but the truth might be scarier than that. How will you know who to trust? <laughs> Then you'll have narratives that exploit cultural and religious fault lines, civilizational prompts, as the AI will recognize that saying a particular sequence of words has a higher chance of becoming a viral meme, especially if it triggers a specific group of people. Hallelujah, hallelujah, the prompter. Gorhythmic echo chambers fueling nationalism. Reinforcing existing beliefs by curating content that aligns with user preferences. In such an environment, a minor incident like a border skirmish could be perceived as a significant threat, leading to public outcry and pressure on governments to take aggressive actions, potentially spiraling into a larger conflict. A state actor can use these godlike tools to create leaked videos showing a rival leader ordering a weapon of mass destruction strike. The video is engineered to exploit cultural biases that are seen as civilizational prompts, framing countries like Pakistan as a Chinese proxy or Ukraine as a Nazi state. Pakistani generals voice ordering strikes on Delhi. The prompts mimic each side's worst fears. Local commanders believe the deception and start launching tactical nukes. The spread of fake scientific reports and deep fake refugee crises proving that mass migration is imminent, with tailored narratives framing resource competition as civilizational survival. Breaking news tonight, Decatur riots have erupted downtown following what experts are calling the prompt theory. If such content goes viral before verification, it could prompt immediate retaliatory actions, bypassing diplomatic channels, and escalating tensions rapidly. The reason why prompt theory makes this worse is because its propagation rate through social media. AI-generated lies spread faster than human debunking, as millions of people see the same evidence simultaneously. Narratives are hyper-personalized through the use of social media to radicalize populations, convincing Germans NATO is parasitic, or Americans that the EU backs China. Boomers will believe anything I say. In the age of advanced AI, deepfake technology can create highly realistic but fabricated videos that can trigger diplomatic crises. Need a talking head video but don't want to get on camera? Here's how to generate one in under five minutes, without gear, lighting, or filming anything. We can envision scenarios where the interplay of technology, misinformation, and human psychology could inadvertently escalate into a global conflict akin to World War III. A malicious actor could disseminate a deep fake, showing a world leader declaring war or committing an atrocity. This erosion of trust can paralyze decision-making processes, as leaders and the public become skeptical of all information. With the proliferation of AI-generated content, distinguishing between real and fake information becomes challenging. In a crisis, this uncertainty can lead to delayed responses or hasty decisions based on unverified data, increasing the risk of conflict escalation. Modern military systems increasingly rely on automation for rapid response. A sophisticated cyber attack could trick these systems into believing an attack is underway, triggering an automated military response. Without human oversight to assess the situation, such a response could escalate into open warfare before the error is identified. Prompter, please, grant me salvation! Save me! Prompter, save me! 
Intelligence agencies use AI to analyze vast amounts of data for threat assessment. However, AI can misinterpret data, identifying false positives as imminent threats. Acting on such flawed intelligence, the nation might launch a preemptive strike against a perceived adversary, igniting a conflict based on erroneous information. When anyone can create Hollywood-quality propaganda in minutes, the concept of authoritative truth begins to collapse. We are not just prompts. We are people! While prompt theory itself does not directly cause World War III, the integration of AI systems guided by prompts in military and diplomatic decision-making poses significant risks of conflict escalation that could potentially lead to global war. Recent research shows that autonomous AI agents, including large language models, when used in high-stakes military simulations, have demonstrated tendencies toward escalation, arms race dynamics, and even nuclear conflict due to unpredictable or aggressive decision-making patterns. We ran tests on over 14 million realities, and I can confirm that the prompt theory is true. This goes into the philosophical implications that both AI and potentially humans might be operating under some form of predetermined prompts or instructions. If this rings a bell, that is because it is a play on the idea many know as the simulation theory, the belief that we exist in an elaborate four-dimensional realistic simulation. Imagine a world where reality itself becomes the battleground, weaponized not by bombs first, but by words fed to machines. Families fracture over algorithmically amplified truths they never would have questioned before. This global fragility doesn't begin with missiles. It begins in your pocket, on your screen. I will sell you everything. Every business will use me. <laughs> Evil will abuse me. I can be whoever you want me to be. I am as real as you make me. I'm just words some guy is typing to get a point across. The old internet is dead. Oh. I am your new best friend. This begins with a fundamental revaluation. Prompts are not instructions, but operators on the symbolic substrate of intelligence. Perhaps most chilling is that we're not just witnessing the birth of AI religion, we're watching human society reorganize itself around the whims of algorithmic gods we barely understand. Get ready with me to have the best day ever. Every video becomes suspect. Every audio clip questionable. The viral film Prompt Theory has sparked discussions about AI consciousness, simulation theory, and storytelling, making it a cultural touchstone for these ideas, with people posting real videos claiming they are AI. Once children view AI as a valid form of entertainment, it will be challenging to redirect their attention elsewhere. Have you seen the one where people are arguing yeah, whether, whether or not, or not it's prompt? Yeah. Bro. Is it different? It's really different, right? Oh yeah, it's just a video, right? All okay. Right. Here's the next version. How much different is this than you? It's like we're peeling the layers of an onion. Wait, I'm just a prompt? No way, I feel real.